happy Tuesday. I am so pumped to see that so many of you are owning your journey. Whatever that looks like, we're all in different seasons. This is not a one size fits all group. And so I'm really proud of those of you who are showing up and you're sharing your journey. And even those of you who are quietly just, you know, being peeping Toms, that's okay too. This is your journey. So I want you to run your race. I want you to find all the joy and all the ways that you are succeeding and you're getting some wins and getting traction because this is not about, this is not about motivation. This, this is Manny. Manny is here. He wants to say hi. Say hi, Manny. <laughs> it's not about motivation. It's not about you having some aha, come to Jesus moment. It's not about a number on the scale or the size of your clothes. This is about you choosing you. This is about you showing up and loving yourself enough to do the hard work and to do the things that feel uncomfortable and overwhelming and maybe scary and intimidating. It's okay. We've all been there. I've been there. I remember it so well. And there's still times that kind of freak me out, but you're, it's your journey and there's no wrong or right way to do it unless you quit and you give up. So those of you who maybe have given up in the past, but you've recommitted to your journey, I just want you to know I'm super proud of you. And I believe in every single one of you. Even if I don't know you in real life, I believe in you. And sometimes we need someone else to believe in us before we'll believe in ourselves. So I believe in all of you. Today is day 14. I am doing the Beachbody Ultimate Reset. Um, and a lot of you have had a lot of questions about it. So if you have questions I haven't answered, drop a comment. Um, but so far, so good. Today is the final day in phase two. There's three phases, and this is the detox phase. So I have to take, um, I take two of these every before every meal, Optimize, and you do this for the entire thing. So come sell your supplements. Um, this is Optimize, which helps you, ab helps you absorb nutrients in your food. So I have to take these. I'm gonna have lunch in half an hour. That's why I'm telling you this. So I'm gonna take two of these, and then I have this detox drink that I add to a little bit of water. And if you've done the three-day refresh, this tastes way better than the fiber sweep. I don't know what they put in that fiber sweep, like cardboard or something. This actually tastes pretty good. And eight times out of 10, I can get it down and I enjoy it. <laughs> I don't know, every so often I'm like, ugh. Um, so I'm doing that. And then this afternoon, before I have a snack, if I have a snack just in the afternoon, I'm doing, I have power greens and so, I actually went ahead and ordered more of these for when I'm done because I really, I don't like the taste of them, but I like the way they make me feel. Like I have an energy bump and I just really, I really like that. So I am gonna be continuing with my greens. Um, and then in the evening I take this, I take Soothe, which, uh, what does this do? Let's see, this uh, supports digestive health and the body's response to oxidative stress. So I take this and then tomorrow I start phase three. So I start in with new supplements. I don't know, I'll let you know how that goes. But um, I'm at like an eight pound weight loss and mostly I just feel really good. I feel calmer. Um, I still have cravings and I, I'm really, e I can so easily see now like what my triggers are. Like certain people make me wanna have a coffee. <laughs> certain experiences make me wanna have a candy bar. But I guess that's part of the process is just being aware of it. So just giving you a little 411 on what's happening. I did some planning today. I am so behind on my messages. So if you are in my inbox, I apologize. I'm not ignoring you. I'm coming for you, but I wanted to do some planning because we have some super cool, exciting things coming up in the tribe. First thing is there's a coach call. So if you're part of our coach tribe, I want you to plug in, whether or not you're here to rock your journey or just share, or share with other people or both or none of the above, whatever, you are welcome to join us. Um, that will start tomorrow, Wednesday evening at 5 p.m. Pacific. And that'll be a standing date that we're bringing back now that all the kids are in school and it's time to just d lean in and work on becoming the best version of ourselves as far as the business goes. So that happens tomor tomorrow at 5 p.m. Next Monday, we're starting a Gratitude Academy and it's gonna run for two weeks. This group runs continuously. If you're new here, we are always, always running. We don't take time off. Your journey is a living, breathing, constantly evolving thing. And I expect you to show up to it on all the days. Doesn't have to be perfect. Doesn't mean you're doing a workout per se. It just means that you're drinking your water and you're reminding yourself of your truths and you're celebrating the fact that you're here alive in this moment. That's freaking awesome, you guys. So starting on Monday, we're gonna start our Gratitude Academy, which like I said, will run for 14 days. And I'm really encouraging you to combine it with either your preferred nutrition plan if you can't work out or and or your um, your current workout program. And if you don't know what to do, that's why you have a coach. And if I'm not your coach, reach out to the person who is and just ask them for a little bit of guidance. 
as coaches, we're not perfect people that have it all figured out, but we're committed to this journey and we want you, we invited you to come along on this process with us. So don't be shy. If you don't know what to do, we would love to help you find a solution. If you're doing a workout that you absolutely hate, it's like gnashing of teeth, stop. Okay. I'm all for trusting the process and completing things, but if you freaking hate it, if it robs you of joy, just stop. There's enough in life that is hard and this time of year can get really hairy. So I want you to find something that hopefully sparks joy. And if it doesn't spark joy, it's something that you actually can appreciate that feels good while you're in it, or at least when you're done. Um, starting on Wednesday, I will be comp done with my ultimate reset. I had to think about it there for a second. And so I have committed to going back to 80 day obsession. I did 80 day obsession. It'll be two years ago when it first came out in January of what are we? This is 2018 is when it came out and I freaking loved it. I was in a really awful car accident and I didn't complete it. I walked away from that car accident and I attribute the fact that I was really, really strong. Like I was so freaking strong. I was able to walk away from an accident that totaled two vehicles. It was really bad. Um, with just minimal, minimal stuff. And I had, was doing Bowen therapy. And of course, Jesus kept me safe and my car was awesome, but I really believe in my heart that I was in such good physical and emotional condition that I was able to walk away from that program. I didn't finish it. Um, I kind of let life spiral a little bit because life happens, right? But that's bothered me and I really enjoyed that program. I didn't like Autumn. I'm not gonna lie to you. I did not like Autumn the first time, I, the first couple times I did the 21 day fix with her teeny tiny shorts and her big boobs. She annoyed the shit out of me. I didn't like her. Um, but I gave her a second shot when I did 80 day obsession and I really, really, I think she's different. I think she changed, she's softer. There's less camel toe. <laughs> and I just really enjoyed that program. So it's bothered me that I never completed it so that's what I'm doing. My birthday is January 27th, and so I'll be turning 41, and this is what I'm doing. Doesn't mean you have to do it, but I'm letting you know if you wanna do this with me, if you wanna do 80 Day Obsession, if you have a story where you started it and you got off track, or something you've been intimidated to do, but you feel the nudge to do it, do it with me. Like It's not convenient. It's an 80 day program. The workouts are an hour long. You do need equipment, but it goes really fast, and I need that, that extra layer of I can do hard things like I am so resilient and even though it didn't go the way I planned the first round I can freaking rock this and knock it out of the park and so I want to end my 2019 in the very best shape of my life I want to feel proud of myself I'm already proud of myself like I've I am very resilient and I've done a lot of hard things I can hear you talking to me Brianna um but this is just some this is on my heart and I've had this like I was really wrestling with it I was like it's so it's so inconvenient because it's such a long program and the holidays and it's an hour and all the excuses but the nudge was there just like you guys have a nudge for something I know you do and then all of a sudden you know how you just start getting confirmation from everywhere I had like four different pieces of confirmation and so I I'm really excited to go back to this program, to start from day one and to trust the process and just see what my body and my mind and my spirit is capable of. And so those of you who don't wanna do 80 day obsession with me, that's totally cool. You can commit to your program because this is such a personal journey and I'm not new to this. Like I've been working on mine for four and a half years. So if you're in the baby st stages or you've been start stopping or you've really been struggle busting or you're just new here, you've been working on your journey for a while but you're new to our tribe, I want you to know that where you're at in this moment is exactly where you're supposed to be. And to stop making excuses to keep yourself small because when you keep yourself small and when you don't do the thing that you feel led to do, you rob everyone else of your amazing sparkly potential. So I want you to end this year in the very best shape of your life. I am asking you to commit to a program, whatever that looks like for you. If it's three week yoga retreat or it's pie or it's country heat or it's you're gonna go all in with the ultimate portion fix or to be mindset. I want you to trust yourself and to put those little deposits in your daily piggy bank every single day because that's how we change our lives. It's not about getting motivated or getting inspired. All of a sudden the new year's coming and we gotta get our shit together. We have to undo all the damage we did over the holidays. No, it is about you choosing you. It is about you getting so connected to your why and your belief that you're worth it. And a lot of you don't believe that you are. You think that it's not a priority and that you need to put it off. But I'm telling you, 
you are a priority and you need to make yourself a priority because if you don't put on your own oxygen mask as we move into these next couple of busier months, your family is gonna feel it and you're gonna feel it. And who has time for that? So you can fit a workout in 10 minutes, 20 minutes, 30 minutes, an hour. There's so many options available to you and if you don't know what to do or you don't know where to begin, that's what this group is for. Drop a comment, tag your coach, reach out to one of us in Messenger. I mean, seriously, this is your journey, own it. So that's what's coming up. We have a coach call on Wednesday. Next Monday, we start our Gratitude Academy. Feel free to invite a friend. They have to join the tribe. So that means they need to get tools so that they can do this with us. But once you're in, you're in for forever. I never kick people out, um, unless you're doing some janky weird shit. <laughs> but this is your place. So it's your pace, it's your speed, it's a place you belong, and I hope that you plug into. If you need anything, if you want to do 80 day obsession with me, if you're interested in saving money, because earlier today I shared the um, $20 off challenge pack. So if you're going to do 80 day obsession, you need new loops or you need more sliders, this is the perfect time to jump on that business. Um, and what else did I want to tell you? Oh, we also have an info group that um, you can go navigate, you can go explore too. We talk about our upcoming programs, which the next one on the bubble is BAR. So BAR is a super awesome program and I'm really pumped to do it once I'm done with 80 Day Obsession. Anyways, friends, I hope today is an amazing day. I hope that you choose to make it an amazing day, that you drink your water, that you remind yourself of all of your truths and all the ways you are succeeding and all the reasons that you can do this. No matter what the other people in your life say, no matter what that inner bully might say, you can do hard things. You were made for more. You can show up and own this. And it starts today. It starts with your water. It starts with your shake. It starts with some spinach or an apple. It starts with you making little tiny daily decisions. That's the stuff that compounds. That's the stuff that changes your life.